Okay, all right, we're here with Bruce. He's the head cheer and mascot coach here at Texas Tech. Game day today. That's right, exciting. It's the first time we worked really hard this summer getting ready during our summer camp. Um, and then also the work, what we call work week right before school. So we had two day practices just getting the squad ready with our traditionals as well as our, all our game day stunts and pyramids, baskets, all the fun stuff that you'll see on the sidelines. So. Awesome, awesome. Girls, are the girls and guys ready? Absolutely, yes. It's a fun group. They've been working together really well and really just supporting everybody and just teaching the vets have really stepped up and just uh, taught all the traditionals that are important to us here at Texas Tech. Right, right. Now, now kind of go into that a little bit. What's um, like all the preparation that leads up to the football season? Sure. Just kind of, you know, take us through like your tryout phase and what it takes to get them ready for, for today. Okay. Yeah, tryouts are the first weekend of May. And what I do is everybody has to try it again. The veterans have to try it again to earn their spot back. Um, we go through four sections. So there's a tumbling section, standing and running, um, and then a game day piece where we'll teach them a sideline chant and a fight song. And then we'll go into stunts um, to where that is, we're looking for game day stunts, so all like the toss lips, uh, pull up, um, ball ups, things like that, the body positions for the girls. Um, and then for the guys, we're looking at the strength, you know, are they able to do a good toss? And then also a component for the co-ed is we move into our elite sequence to where we start, I want to see kind of what they come up with to um, start piecing together some nationals pieces, you know, uh, the backhand spring ups, the front hand springs, the rewinds, things like that. So those will be during our final segment. Um, and then also the fourth piece of uh, tryouts is our interview. It's very important as to that you're representing our program well. Uh, as you see here today, that they have a lot of crowd interactions to where I want to make sure that they can communicate and just carry that conversation and be a good representation for Texas Tech. So we have an interview and to where they sit down um, individually, uh, the finalists do with me and a couple other coaches and staff um, to where that, that's the way we'll interview them to make sure they are able to carry on their tradition here at Tech. Awesome. So, and great. then we start in, um, the, each squad has a week in the summer to where they come back and that's our skills camp and development there to where um, I make sure for co-ed to really partner, um, the, all the partner stunts work well and then all girl make sure to form in our groups, uh, our stunt groups uh, that will showcase on the sidelines and then also build up for that national piece too to find those elite, uh, those top six girls and those, those guys too for that. Awesome. And then a week before school we report and we just have two to three days um, for a week long and that's getting ready for all our appearances, testing their traditionals, um, just making everything final push right before the first home football game. Awesome. Well, they look ready. Well, thank you very much. I, I hope they are. We have a great week. Uh, practices this first week and I think everybody's ready to go. That's great. Well, let's, uh, let's go into one other part of your, um, your guys' program okay. and that's the national competition program. Right. You guys got that. How, how does that all kind of work and how do you kind of tie all that together? I know you guys, you know, you obviously the football and then you got the nationals here at the end and they want to meet. Sure. And I like to prepare. Yeah. Start early. And so we, we'll start figuring out what elite stud sequence we want, what pyramids we want, what tumbling can we sync together. We start that early and then I have our choreographers come in the first part of the fall semester to really just kind of evaluate the squad, kind of see where we're at, and then start piecing together certain sections. Um, and then come back in January and we kind of have everything that we want to do already laid out. We've had practices of doing that and then we just piece it together with all the choreography starting in January and start running the routine as soon as everything gets set. So, But then also we tie in some of those key features for performances, special performances such as uh, Raider Alley today and then uh, different timeouts and things where it's safe, you know, and ACA certified to where um, with a space figured out to where we can start incorporating some of those national pieces, you know, to perform in front of a crowd. So that's how we kind of practice and prepare for that. So they're not just doing it that one time in Daytona. We'll have little showcases here around Lubbock throughout the year as well. That's great. Awesome. Well, Coach, they look great. And then, Thank uh, you. you guys look like you're ready to roll. Thanks. We appreciate your time. Yeah, not a problem. Thanks for coming. You got it.